the sun is just set here. I don't think you can really see it in the camera, but... Hmm. It's been again brought to my attention, my beautiful old hands. <laughs> I have a little story. So many years ago, I was probably in my late 20s, early 30s, which would put me about 30 years back. <laughs> so um, I went to a party at my former brother-in-law's house. And he was a movie maker, is a movie maker. And uh, this man who was from Egypt, he's a little bit older than me, quite a bit at that time. And uh, he was a palm reader, and he, this, this hand has always looked this old, I think. It's always been old. I know that. I remember that. But um, this hand got old in my late 20s, got old early. And I remember being at a Sundance meeting, a medicine man, his name was Old Hands. And I fell in love with my hands. <laughs> but, um, so this Egyptian palm reader, as well as other things, I think he was a movie maker too, but he said he never saw lines on a hand like this before. Don't know what to do with that. But I, he went on to tell me a story. And when he was about nine years old, he, he went into a, um, a field trip into the Great Pyramid and he lingered behind and ended up getting locked in there and they all left him. So he was in there for hours and hours until he eventually figured out where he was and came and got him. It was um, early morning. So he, he, he said that um, he played with Egyptian children all night long, a game. And when his parents and the authorities came and found him and he told him the story, them the story, no one believed him. And he said he kept trying to talk to his mom and dad and tell him the story again and again. And nobody believed him. And eventually, they discovered they, this game is, is actually in the, the museum there. And they didn't know how it was played. And he was able to tell them, because this was the game that he played with the children, he was able to tell them how to play the game. And when he said that, when he said that to me, I was just like, can I touch your third eye? <laughs> and he said to me, that's exactly what Jim Morrison said when I told him that story. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> blown away. <laughs> I was like, so no, well, always forever probably remember that at least this life <laughs> I've forgotten a lot of things I haven't forgotten that one um, I have a lot of stories this one isn't really a story about magic but I have through more than more than 35 years of, of painting um, I have many, many stories of magic, and I really look forward to sharing them with you. So, um, hmm, that's it for now. Have a beautiful, beautiful sleep day, wherever you are in the world. I love you.